Hey guys, welcome back to Mitzi Creek Farm. I am Katie and we are a pumpkin patch and Christmas tree farm in Northern Wisconsin. We bought this property five years ago and we started growing Christmas trees and pumpkins four years ago. And um, in our previous video, you saw we were having a bit of a chaotic morning and we are back from doing everything we needed to do. And now it is time to head down and start getting all the snow from last night's snowstorm off of the Christmas trees that we sell. We are down here and Beck found a new cool way to clean off the trees and the snow on the trees. Look at those, aren't they beautiful? That is beautiful, but people don't wanna buy trees with all that, that much snow on them. So usually we come down, we shake them all off um, and um, pick everything up. Well, we have these new fancy clips this year and we have not needed to pick up a single tree yet. So that is great, but um, we still need to shake off the trees or clean them off. And so Beck is gonna show us what he does to clean off the trees. Go ahead, bud. So this is just a small leaf blower. He got this for his birthday in a tool kit that he got. And so he's able to put a battery in and just come down and blow off the trees with his leaf blower. And just like that, our trees are nice and clean. So now that this is all we have left for trees, we're almost sold out. Um, we are able to take this back area that's closest to the highway and plow the snow, take the trees from over here, move them up to empty spots up here, and then plow all the snow back there. Um, and then that way we have um, a nice spot that isn't gonna be around where people are walking to move them um, or to put all the snow there. So that is good. Um, and where before we just would take and shovel paths. So this makes it a whole lot easier. Now what we're gonna do is we're just gonna come through and shovel some of these berm areas. Uh, the wind is picking up. And um, tonight we have our Christmas campfire. So we have a uh, campfire going, we have marshmallows, s'mores, and hot apple cider. And so that will be tonight. So we really don't wanna spend all day down here because we're gonna be down here all night. So when we come back down, we're just gonna get this last berm out of here, essentially get the snow moved so that people can get access this really easily. And then tonight while we're down here, um, there will be at least the three kids and I down here and um, we will move these trees. Um, these are the massive ones that we have left. Uh, that one that's leaning there, that one's like a 12 footer. That one is 11, almost 12 feet. Um, this one looks like a 10 footer and that one is probably a nine footer right back there. Anyways, um, so what we'll do is we'll take these guys and we will move them to along the edge of the fence on the outside so that they're easy for people to carry. And then we'll get all this stuff that's right here out of here. And then we can plow uh, all the extra snow here for the rest of the season. Um, then that way our trees are condensed and it's easier to plow and all of that. I thought you guys would like our little trick on how we get the snow off of the trees. That has worked really well. Next year, I will um, have put on my put on my budget for next year uh, a bigger blower because that works really well. Um, the problem is the batteries die quickly on that one um, because it is just a tiny little guy with a small battery. So next year we will have a bigger one, and that will 
really make things go faster. But that is it for today's video. Thanks for tuning in guys and we'll see you next time.